Welcome back to Talk of the Town. I'm joined now by Mercury Stardust, and you are a burlesque dancer with Five Nightclub. Thank you so much for being here today. Well, thank you for having me. I'm glad to have you on the show. And as you can see, it's a really nice addition to our set, the blue and the sparkles. You just shine in the light here, so I love <laughs> it. So first, I just wanted to talk about Five Nightclub, and they do quite a few different events. So could you just tell me a little bit more about Five Nightclub in particular? Well, Five Nightclub is um, a traditionally gay bar in town. Okay. They do uh, drag events, and they also do now burlesque performances uh, monthly. Awesome. And it's a really great eclectic place for people to come yeah. and kind of have a great time. And that's just a fun place for everybody go, to go, you know, for those type of events. Yeah. Um, burlesque or, like you said, the, the drag shows, that's a lot of fun. Get a bunch of friends involved and go have an awesome night out on the town, so yeah. that's great. And like I said, you're a burlesque dancer, and I just wanted to talk about your start in burlesque. How did you get involved in that? Well, I started out in burlesque because I was a cabaret performer who traveled all around the country doing various shows. And every once in a while, we will see shows with burlesque performers. Yeah. And they were really fancy, and they're over the top. And you didn't see many men do it. Yeah. And one time, I saw a man do it, and I was like, great. I could do that better. Uh, <laughs> and I kind of just jumped into it head first, and I've been doing it ever since. So it's been about three years now of just wow. doing solid burlesque. And I run the association town, and it's been a lot of fun. Now, like you just mentioned, the Wisconsin Association of Burlesque Dancers, is that the correct name? It's, um, it's called the Wisconsin Burlesque Association, Burlesque or Association. WEBA for short. Okay. And we ran the first ever Wisconsin Burlesque Festival this year in April. We had over 50 performers from across the country and various parts of the world. Wow. And it was a lot of fun. And we try to uh, work together. We're a very different community compared to the rest of the burlesque community. Sure. So uh, Madison and Wisconsin is very storytelling based um we're less sparkly besides me yeah. and we're more like um in the audience a lot having a lot of interactions and we work together for all our shows across the state do you have quite a few members in that association from yes across we do the state? so it's a it's like if you perform you're a member yeah. if you like it or not so it's like 120 odd performers across uh, the whole state so we have awesome. performers in oshkosh appleton la crosse and Green Bay and, of course, Madison. Really everywhere, it sounds like. Really everywhere. <laughs> awesome. Do you guys have any events coming up? Yes, we burlesque do. burlesque in particular or just any events at the nightclub? Yes. Um, Five Nightclub has two monthly shows that strictly are burlesque or various performances. Okay. And uh, one show is called Mercury Stardust. That's me. That's you. That's yes, totally me. Um, Mercury Stardust Strip and Shout. That's the second Thursday of every month at 10 p.m. And then we have Baby Bear's Battle Royale, and that is a show where you'll see burlesque performers, uh, pole performances, and drag performances all in one. Okay. And then they'll compete for the title of, like, the king or queen of Battle Royale. Oh, wow. Yeah. I was going to ask about how the name got started there. Well, Battle Royale started about a year ago with another b um, burlesque performer by the name of Baby, Baby Bear in town. Oh, okay. So and that he, Yeah. And he... Well, was very adamant that he wanted to bring new performances to uh, to the stage. And before there, there really wasn't much burlesque happening at Five Nightclub, but that's when it started to happen. And then I got involved with Five, and we've been doing this ever since. So oh, how yeah. much fun. Yeah. What would you say is your favorite part of, you know, working with Five Nightclub and being a burlesque dancer, and even the association, too? Sounds like you kind of do a little <laughs> bit of everything. Yeah, it is true. Uh, my <laughs> favorite part is working with people who have not had an experience of expressing themselves that fully on stage. Yeah. You have people who are in their 50s and 60s who have been told their entire life that they're not, you know, beautiful, that, you know, they need to be in this tight little box. And then you give them the power to go on stage and do their own thing and just seeing that light up on stage is right. absolutely, uh, tremendously powerful for, pe for people. So. Is that kind of the experience you had as well when you started? Absolutely. I had my own, even as a male in our society, I had problems with my own body image. Yeah. Like, I did not like how I looked. I just, I was disgusted by myself. Mm -hmm. And then burlesque kind of started giving me that power back. Like, you know, it's okay to be this way. I'm a little goofy. I'm a little weird, but I'm also very beautiful in my own way. So. Awesome. Yeah. I love that. That's a good message for everybody. Mm -hmm. And where can people come find you and come watch the shows? Well, they can come to Five Night Club um, on the dates I talked about uh, at the second Thursday or the last Thursday of every month at Five Night Club. You can also find us on Five Night Club on Facebook and you can just Google us and you'll see all the shows. Awesome. And if you want to know all the Wisconsin burlesque shows across the whole state and in Madison, you go to wisconsinburlesqueassociation.com and there's a calendar on there. 
and has all the shows. So, Love it. Yeah. Mercury Stardust, our burlesque dancer with Five Night Club. Thank you for being here today. Thank you. And Talk of the Town will be back with more right after this.